Folks, this is an invitation to have you guys jump into the fray with Matt's beautiful 100 Answers for Beautiful. It's uh, an old vid, but it's uh, one that deserves in my hairs in this array. There we go. Uh, it's an old vid, but it's actually something that's not that old. And the question always raises, uh, not goose flesh, goose bumps, not really. Uh, more, it raises um, an emotional defense shield on most people because they don't want to say anything. Well, Matt, I loved what you did. I loved the courage that you showed in being able to go up to these people and actually ask them yourself while holding the mic. What do you think is beautiful? What does beautiful mean for you? Well, the f beautiful for me, uh, I'll throw in my two cents since you did this and I want it to actually snowball for you. Um, the beautiful definition for me is a a a anything that strikes me as impossible to forget, impossible to see, impossible to do, impossible to have. And that doesn't mean beautiful as in beautiful female, beautiful man, beautiful. It's more like beautiful everything. Um, there are many things that stick to mind when you see something that you, you yourself, as the beholder of the beauty, decide to actually put it into your mind's canvas and it never goes away. Now you can try to film it, picture it, paint it, and do whatever you wish with it, really. Um, if we're talking about female uh, companionship, beauty from a woman is vast and varied when it comes to what men find attractive or find beautiful. But I do know one thing out of my own experience, beauty is only a skin deep. Meaning that if you're a person who has an outgoing personality and who has everything that goes well with it, positive thoughts, positive vibes, fun laughing, all that stuff together, and you're beautiful on the outside, then you're going to be beautiful for a long period of your time, even up until your death. But if you're somebody who's shallow, who just puts up a facade, the only thing that you have to stand on is the beauty on the outside if you're a very beautiful person. Unfortunately, that fades away with time. The people that found you beautiful then may not find you beautiful in the future. And they may start to drift away because of it. As for things, depending on what it is, they may fade, they may tarnish, they may turn, they may rust, they may corrode, they may simply get stolen. Uh, so many things can happen to things that we deem beautiful, but it's also things that we have around us and our nature too. Uh, look at our national parks here in Canada. A lot of them have beautiful scenery, beautiful locations, beautiful land being used for a beautiful purpose. But that said, well, that's pretty much it. There's nothing more for me to throw in. So folks, please give your own version of uh, what is beautiful for you and give him an answer. Have a nice one, Matt.